In this tutorial, we are going to learn about asymptotic notations. So, now asymptotic notations are uh, types and we will define the So, algorithm basic operation count and the algorithm efficiency measure and the algorithm basic operation order of growth and compare so now algorithm efficiency it depends on the basic operations and the algorithm use the basic operation depend panida and the algorithm efficiency irukku so ipo and the algorithm uh, the basic operation oda order of growth vandu uh, mention pandradukaga scientist vandu three notations vandu introduce pannanga and the three notations enna illana first vandu big o notation so the big o notation eppadi mention pannuvanga na big o so second notation is big omega notation idu enna solluvanga na big omega so the third notation is big theta so the notation ka paaru big theta so ipo vandu nama one by one na over notations sa patti nama vandu detail la paaka porom so the notations sa padikiradhukku munnala rules vandu nama and algorithm in the notations la use panna porom so adhula enna na t of n appadina running time of the algorithm running time of the algorithm so the running time on the depends on the basic operation count this running time depends on the basic operation count of the particular algorithm so next one the g of n and chali or function is panaporo so it is the some symbol function some symbol function to compare compare the count so first paak pora notation enna na big o notation so ipo the big o notation oda definition eppadi na so ipo parunga big o oda definition enna na a function t of n is said to be order of g of n denoted denote of n belongs to order of g of n if t of n is bounded above by some constant multiples of g of n for all large n so ipo vande this g of n vande um, t of n vande belongs to order of g of n nu solli eppo solluvona t of n less than or equal to c into g of n adan solli irukku t of n is bounded above by some constant multiples of g of n so constant multiple na c in solli edukrom t of n less than or equal to c into g of n for all n greater than or equal to n zero so idu da big o notation oda definition so ipo vandu idanoda diagram namu vandu paakumbodhu eppadina so idu vandu n n n ngiradhu size of the input n ngiradhu size of the input idu vandu t so ipo vandu after some n zero value after some n zero value this t of n grows like this this c into g of n grows like this so this is called as here we have already defined the definition t of n is lesser than c into g of n so this is called as t of n this is called as c into g of n so example of big o notation kuduthirukanga 100 n plus 5 belongs to big o of n square we have to prove like this so so if f of n belongs to order of g of n f of n is said to be 
order of g of n then if f of n less than or equal to c into g of n erkenave namu paathirukku so appo namma idu vandu proof prove pannanumna f of n is less than or equal to c into g of n nu solli irukkaporam so f of n ngiradhu enna na 100 n plus 5 g of n vandu n square so f of n ngiradhu enna na 100 n plus 5 less than or equal to c into n square so ipo vandu ipo inda c ku enna value substitute pannum bodhu inda equation vandu satisfy aagum appdi solli nam vandu paaka porom so appo inda c oda value la nam kandupidikkiradhu oru assumption panna porom enna na இங்க இருக்கக்கூடிய எல்லா டேம்லையும் வந்து நம்ம என் சேர்க்க போகிறோம் அப்போ ஹண்ட்ரட் என் ப்ளஸ் ஃபைவ் என் ஸோ இஸ் ஈக்குவல் டு ஹண்ட்ரட் அண்ட் ஃபைவ் என் ஸோ அப்போ சியோட வேல்யூ ஹண்ட்ரட் அண்ட் ஃபைவாக இருந்ததுன்னா ஸோ திஸ் கண்டிஷன் இஸ் சாட்டிஸ்ஃபை ஸோ இஃப் சி பிகம்ஸ் ஹண்ட்ரட் அண்ட் ஃபைவ் இஃப் சி பிகம்ஸ் ஹண்ட்ரட் அண்ட் ஃபைவ் தென் is equal to 1 that is n not is equal to 1 then this condition is satisfied so we can say that 100 n plus 5 less than or equal to 1 not 5 n square 1 not 5 n square so we can say that 100 of 100 n plus 5 belongs to order of n square order of n square so like that we can prove the big o notation that this is the definition of big omega notation so big omega notation or definition is a function t of n is said to be in big omega of g of n denoted by t of n belongs to big omega of g of n if t of n is bounded below by some constant multiple of g of n for all large n so the equation can be written like this t of n greater than or equal to c into g of n for all n greater than or equal to n zero so this is the equation so if you want to prove this function belongs to big omega of g of n then we have to uh, check this condition t of n greater than or equal to c into g of n in the condition satisfy anada namu vand and particular function and belongs to big omega of g of n nu solli namu vand solla mudiyum so idu oda graphical representation enna na graphical representation so idu vand t nu eduthukrom idu vand n nu solli eduthukrom size of the input so here after n not the t of n function will grow like this the c into g of n function will grow like this this function is called as f of n this is called as this linear function is called as c into g of n so that only we have defined in the definition so this t of n is bounded below by some constant multiple of g of n so now we are going to see the example of this one how to prove that n belongs to big omega of n square so if on the if one function belongs to big omega of n square we have to write the condition t of n greater than or equal to c into g of n for all n greater than or equal to n zero so ipo vandu namai elada porom so here t of n vandu n cube g of n vandu n square so ipo we have t n cube greater than or equal to c into n square so ipo 
எப்போ எந்த கா என்ன வேல்யூ சீக்கு சப்ஸ்டியூட் பண்ணும்போது இந்த கண்டிஷன் சாட்டிஸ்ஃபை ஆகும் அப்படின்னு சொல்லி நம்ம கண்டுபிடிக்கணும் ஸோ இப்போ சீக்கு இஃப் சி இஸ் ஈக்வல் டு ஒன் மீன்ஸ் வாட் திஸ் ஈக்வேஷன் பிகம்ஸ் லைக் திஸ் என் கியூ கிரெடினார் ஈக்குவல் டு என் ஸ்கொயர் திஸ் கண்டிஷன் இஸ் சாட்டிஸ்ஃபைடு ஸோ ஹியர் த இன்புட்டோட சைஸ் வந்து என் கிரெடினார் ஈக்குவல் டு ஃபார் ஆல் என் கிரேட்டர் தான் ஆர் ஈக்குவல் டு ஜீரோ ஸோ என்னுக்கு வந்து ஜீரோ கொடுத்தாலும் திஸ் கண்டிஷன் வில் பி சாட்டிஸ்ஃபை இஃப் என் இஸ் என் பிகம்ஸ் ஒன் தட் டைம் ஆல்சோ திஸ் கண்டிஷன் இஸ் சாட்டிஸ்ஃபை ஸோ எப்போ நான் சி இஸ் ஈக்குவல் டு ஒன் ஸோ ஹென்ஸ் வி ப்ரூவ் தேட் ஹென்ஸ் வி ப்ரூவ் தேட் டி ஆஃப் என் நாட் என் கியூ பிலாங்ஸ் டு பிக் ஒமேகா ஆஃப் என் ஸ்கொயர் The definition of theta notation is a function t of n is said to be in theta of g of n denoted by t of n belongs to theta of g of n if t of n is bounded both above and below by some positive constant positive constant multiples of g of n for all large n so this is the definition of theta notation so here this theta notation is for uh, to uh, to prove this t of n belongs to theta of g of n we have to uh, write the condition that is c2 into g of n c2 into g of n less than or equal to t of n less than or equal to c1 into g of n for all n greater than or equal to n0 so appo or function vand belongs to theta notation a irundaduna so adha eppadi nama vand and condition satis check pannanumna c2 into g of n less than or equal to t of n less than or equal to c1 into g of n so the graphical representation of theta notation eppadi irukuna so idu vand n மூமெண்ட் சோ ஆஃப்டர் சம் n0 இன்புட் தி ஃபங்ஷன் f of n will grow like this f of n then c1 into g of n will grow like this c2 into g of n will grow like this this is called as t of n this is called as c1 into g of n this is called as c2 into g of n so ipo vandu in the t of n oda value vandu lies between this c1 into g of n and c2 into g of n so t of n oda value vandu c1 into g of n ku mela pogadhu so it won't go below of the c2 into g of n so for t of n na irkenave namu paatha time efficiency function so this time efficiency will go between the c1 into g of n and the c2 into g of n